You know, these trucks are the unrestorables, the forgotten trucks, man. They've been used, abused, and left to die. And so we figure they still have some life left. So we decided let's give our employees these unrestorable trucks. And that's how the story began. The first one that was built was a like a 79 Scout Terra. And uh, it got dubbed terrible. So we said, you know what? Let's take a terrible road trip. Wait, what are you doing? Don't, don't start the truck. Let's have a quick conversation about what happens upon the unlikely event that a truck catastrophically breaks. That's why we're bringing tools. We are bringing tools. I still need to get what is uh, the likelihood we want to take any bets on which one drinks <laughs> first? Get a little kitty. Considering this guy's got like bit. five miles on it. <laughs> Breaking first? Yeah. That was the most roadworthy. Mm. The most road tested. Tested. Yeah. Uh, it's um, the espresso. <laughs> yeah, I'm hungry, man. Let's do it. We started in Ames, Iowa, here at the Anything Scout shop, and our destination was the Scout Nationals in Ohio. It's like 10 o'clock. Now's the time suit up and log some miles man we need to go four hours Dude. expect the unexpected come on that's all you can do just take my money <laughs> <laughs> two o'clock we'll see that's doable man I might just be, I might just be sleeping at the truck stop. Billy's right. <clears throat> Would have been better if we left at lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Woulda, coulda, shoulda. We build high-end, like really nice restored trucks, um, and there, there's definitely a place for them as daily drivers, and they're beautiful to look at. Um, but this is just something fun for us, man, to get out there. It's not if they break down, it's when they break down. So that's part of the fun of the trip. So we do some camping, do some eating, road tripping, it's getting out back to that sense of adventure and opportunity. I think the idea of it is the less preparation, the better. <laughs> that's sort of how it goes. Um, there's definitely got a little like paint pen checklist written on the truck that things to do for 2018 here, so. It'll probably be like two days before we leave that I'll get to that list. That's how it goes, man. That's the terrible's road trip. 